more than 800 killed on mainland China. The death toll from the coronavirus has surpassed that of the SARS outbreak from 2002 to 2003. However, the World Health Organization said the number of new infections seems to be steadying, but it's too early to say if it has peaked. There has been a stabilization in the, the number of uh, cases reported from Hubei, and uh, we're in a sort of a four-day stable period where the disease uh, or the number of reported cases hasn't advanced. SARS, from the same family of coronavirus as the new strain, killed 774 people and infected over 8,000, mainly in mainland China and Hong Kong. The new virus is so far proving to be less deadly. Chinese authorities say 2 to 3 percent of those infected have died, while SARS killed 9.6 percent, according to the World Health Organization. In Wuhan, the epicenter of the outbreak, Factories are working to fill a nationwide shortage of protective equipment. China's National Health Commission warned against excessive and disorderly use of protective clothing, saying it could waste resources and increase infection. With a population of 24 million, global financial hub Shanghai has become the latest city obliging residents to wear masks in public. Meanwhile, many regions across the country are only allowing one person per household to go out every two days to buy supplies.